This is not the first time Park Geun-hye had to leave the presidential office of Changwade. 38 years ago, she left following the assassination of her father, Park Jung-hee, a highly controversial leader. Kim Min-ji zooms in on the deja vu. Park Geun-hye arrived at the presidential office of Changwade for the first time back in 1963, when her father, Park Jung-hee, was elected the fifth president of South Korea. Sixteen years later, on October 26, 1979, the elder Park was assassinated and Park Geun-hye was forced to leave the presidential compound along with her sister and brother. Together, the three siblings moved to their private residence in Shindangdong near central Seoul. Later, Park moved to her current home in Samsungdong, where she lived in seclusion for 18 years before stepping into politics in 1998. Fifteen years after that, due in part to the political experience she'd gained as serving as first lady after her mother was assassinated, Park returned to the top office in 2013 after her election as the 18th president of South Korea. And now, with just 11 months left in her term, Park has been forced to leave the top office once again as the first president to be impeached after one of the biggest political scandals in Korea's modern history. Kim Min-ji, Arirang News.